Welcome to our video exploring the captivating world of Japanese movies from the 1950s. This pivotal era witnessed incredible artistic achievements, giving birth to cinematic masterpieces that shape the future of filmmaking in Japan and beyond. Join us as we delve into a time when visionary directors like Akira Kurosawa and Yasujiro Ozu revolutionized storytelling techniques, tackling profound themes while pioneering new genres, such as samurai cinema and family dramas. Through this journey, we'll uncover how these films left an indelible mark on Japanese culture and continue to inspire filmmakers worldwide. Seven Samurai, 1954, directed by the legendary filmmaker Akira Kurosawa, Seven Samurai is a timeless masterpiece and a defining film of Japanese cinema. Set in 16th century feudal Japan, the story revolves around a village constantly targeted by bandits. In an effort to protect themselves, the villagers hire seven skilled samurai warriors to defend their community. The movie delves deep into themes of honor, sacrifice, and the inherent struggles of social class. It showcases both intense action sequences and intimate character development, presenting complex individuals with their own motivations and personal demons. Seven Samurai inaugurated the concept of assembling a team of warriors to undertake an impossible mission that has since become widely recognized in countless films across various genres. Rashomon, 1950, directed again by Akira Kurosawa, Rashomon is another highly influential film that challenges conventional narrative expectations through its unique storytelling technique. The movie centers around an incident where a woman is raped while her husband is murdered in ancient Japan's forests. What sets this film apart is its exploration of multiple perspectives on the same event as told by different characters with conflicting accounts. This examination exposes subjective truths and highlights how unreliable human memory can be when influenced by personal biases or self-preservation instincts. Rashomon raised international cinematic eyebrows at the time for its unconventional structure and philosophical depth while fostering discussions about subjectivity versus objectivity within storytelling.